Welcome back everybody to Oberkirkheim. So I've been picking up the straw from this field, the soybean field that we harvested last time. Sorry about that, had to check something. Um, yeah, so I've been picking up the straw from this soybean field. Um, it turns out we can actually store this in our uh, silo that's kind of already on the farm. So I don't have to worry about um, selling it or dumping it anywhere. I can kind of just put it in there for now. So that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, and the, this uh, this silo actually holds two million liters, so should be plenty for our use. And you can see if I go in here, about five thousand wheat, fifteen thousand soybean. Oh yeah, we have some seeds, um, and one hundred thirty-nine thousand straw. So quite a bit. Um, I mean, our obviously use that for the cows here and there. Um, but I don't really don't think they're gonna go through that much that quickly. So I think I talked about doing this last time, but um, my plan is to buy this. And actually, let me check. Yeah, forty thousand. So my plan is to buy that at some point whenever I get you know some some income um actually where do i want to put this let's put it over here i think one of these is empty if i can get it in straight Perfect. Now yeah, let's just park this up in here right now. Cool. All right, this is uh, the stuff we're going to use next time. All right, so yeah, we got one more month on this grass. We do need to get a pH spreader. Unfortunately, there actually is one for sale uh, in the sales, but I don't have I don't have enough for it. So we're just gonna have to deal with that for now. So I think uh, I think yeah, let's just go to bed. Go to the next month. Let's feed our dog first. There you go. Eight o'clock is fine. So it's going to be a little slow here. Um, I'm going to try to make money kind of based on the stuff it kind of gives you to start with. Um, oh, he was hungry. Look at him. He was like sprinting for it. I want to fill the bowl. Or pet him, I guess. He's just freaking out. No? Can't fill your bowl? There you go. He just ran through the wall somehow. Sure, you do you. Alright, how are the chickens doing? They have... Still have food. Good health. We're still getting eggs. That is great. How many of these can this hold? Okay, so it's almost full. I'm just gonna let it get full and, you know, keep the chickens in there for, for good, really. Um, so this wasn't making any manure last time. And it still was not. Interesting. I'm not sure why this is not making manure. They have straw. Yeah, 
Yeah, it says they have straw, right? Yeah. I wonder if it's because their health is down a little bit because they're not getting TMR. Maybe that's it. Alright, well, they're not going to get TMR here for a while, so... Alright, so the grass is probably ready. Let's grab this tractor. That we have not used yet. Do some grass cutting. Hang it out this way. No, it looks like it. Ooh. Do a few passes here. So I think the the plan is to, you know, try to use some of the, the eggs and the milk and some of the crop from last year to... What was I going to plant? I guess I'm not planting anything. I think I'm actually... I'm going to wait and plant some... What am I going to plant? I'm tempted just to do soybeans again. Because I, no, uh, maybe not. I don't know. We kind of need something for the chickens. We're, we're seeing how much they go through. I might have uh, jumped to the next month too quick. I probably should have planted some barley or something. Um, yeah, we might have to do sorghum. We'll see how it gets when we get to April. But anyways, I'm going to use the the eggs from the chickens and the uh, you know the milk from the cows to kind of make some money here at the beginning and then focus on getting that um, heating plant first and kind of make our money from there because we can put straw in there and you know make some money that way I think you can put grass and something maybe it's not grass I know you can put wood chips. I thought there was something else. I'm not sure though. Do not like this mower. Traffic comes messing me up. Um, hello, I'm working here. That's yeah, fine. Well, it's not straight anymore, but it'll work. Let's actually back up a bit, make it a little easier to see. Alright, yeah, so I'm going to get this, this cut up. Um, I don't want the cows eating grass. It's, it's, it's weird that they make you start with grass. It's actually a little annoying. Um, well, there's only grass left. But the annoying thing is it's taking up some of the room. Um, so I can't... You know, I won't be able to fill it up all the way until I let them eat all that grass. So I guess I'm going to have to wait until they eat that before I put some hay in there just to get rid of it, really. But, yeah, the plan for this is just to make some hay. Just feed them with hay for now. 80% um, is way better than 40%, so... Just a little confused why they're not making manure. I don't know why that would be the thing. I don't think I'm missing anything, but maybe there's something, some issue with this map. 
or something. I'm not sure. And uh, I think so kind of going on with how we're going to make some money. I, th I think the, the way to go once I get the heating plant is just to use some of that income and just stick with the equipment I have and expand the fields. Um, I think in terms of equipment, the only things I really need are something to make TMR, so some TMR mixer. Um, something to spread lime. Let me just back this up. Um, and was that it? That might be it. I might be missing something, but... Oh, um, and I'll have to probably get this first, to be honest. Um, I need something to bury the milk. Let me just double check that I don't have anything. Um, so yeah, I bought that spreader. Of course, I bought the manure spreader, and now I can't pick up any manure, because there's none being made, so... Great. Okay. Um, yeah. So I'm going to have to buy... Let's see what we have to buy. Um, animals. Yeah, I have these lizard mods. I really like these ones because they're super cheap. Um, but they're not negative money, so I cannot buy them now. As nothing in life is, of course. I hope this small little field will be enough for the amount of cows that we have. I would like to not have to make hay at some point um, and make a little bit of silage in the bunker for for some cash to sell off for some cash, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Let's clean up these last few bits. Can I get it all in one go? Oh, it's gonna be close. Nope. Missed a tiny little bit. There we go. Fold that back. Let's see if I can back this in. Oh, yeah. Pretty good, if I say so myself. All right, let's get the tether out. Make it a little bit easier to see going in first person for a second. And drive all over his field. It's fine. This is going to take like two rows. <laughs> because that teeny mower and this gigantic tether. Is it just me or does that look different? I wonder if this... Oh, maybe not. Sorry, I was just wondering if maybe this was like... Um, maze Plus on this map or something. I didn't think so. I didn't see anything about that, but I don't know, this just looked the ted the tedded grass looked a little bit lighter than I was expecting, I guess. Probably getting grass everywhere. It's not as clean of a job as I 
would like to do, but it'll work. Just get this little bit here on the end. There we go. I'll tet it up. See how many times I can back in correctly. Oh, I feel like this is going to be a fail. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay, not too bad. Pick up the last thing, if I can get it. Nice. Teeny tiny wind rower. Actually, let's start. Start over here. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep working on this field and bring you back here when I'm almost done. So, see you in a sec. I brought you guys back in to see if I can back in the third time. <clears throat> Excuse me. This one's much easier since it doesn't have the same kind of hitch on the back all right so we have rows of hay now hey now we have rows <laughs> sorry all right let's try to loop this around now i'm not sure if so no I am not sure if that silo also holds hay, so we will see. If it does, great. Um, if it does not, uh, I might have to leave it in the forage harvester. I'm not sure how many passes this is, how many um, fills this will take. Let me get this little piece here on the end first. Yeah, we're already at 30% after essentially one. So it looks like two or three. Almost missed the turn there. Yeah, I was thinking through some... Uh, Future planning for the grass too. Um, I might, I might even use this field just for some extra farm space. I'm not exactly sure what yet, but you know, it's just some extra room to drive around. Maybe, maybe for some of the big equipment like the harvesting equipment and stuff. That's, that'll be good. I love how on this map. Let me just get out a sec. The sun on this map, because of all the mountains. Step away from the tractor. It's just, you always have the, the shade going. There's so much incredible detail. Um, and I kind of love it. Like, just surrounded by mountains. Yeah. It's fantastic. I would love to take that corn right now, but it's not mine. Hey, maybe we can do corn silage. 
to get a forage harvester for it, but I don't know. Hashtag goals, right? I am not young. Don't laugh at me. All right, let's see if this will fill up. Will this fill us up? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so we'll have a little bit more than a little bit more than one cool um, forage harvester of hay. Once we get the rest. All right, let's go see if this will go in. That um, oh jeez. Across the road over there, uh, for 14 and 15, fields 14 15. I was thinking I could combine those in the middle and just make one really large grass field. Um, that way I don't have to worry about, you know, when I'm spinning around, I don't have to worry about driving on fields with crops. And look, it does take it. That's perfect. Um, yeah, just, you know, when I'm doing my grass fields, I don't want to accidentally drive over the crop and, you know, ruin half of our crop, so. Right now, it's it's fine because those fields aren't ours, so it doesn't let us destroy them. But, obviously, eventually, I want those, these fields to the side of us to be ours, so. Just thinking for the future. Which means I'll probably have to get rid of that tree to do that too but I could just um, I could just loan something for that since I am allowed to lease things um, yeah and I I don't think I don't remember when I made the rules if I said that I was or I had to check check the video check my first video but I don't remember if I said I, if I was allowed to take out a loan or not um, I'm inclined to say no I don't have one as of now, and actually I uh, checked the, what I was spending money on, and it's a little bit on water and property maintenance. I'm not sure which piece is the property maintenance, but I mean, that's fine. You can kind of think of it as rent or house payments or whatever, which means we will have... Excuse me, car. We will have some, you know, negative values here for a little while. Like, like I said before, I'm going to try to do most of, at least at the beginning, most of the field work myself um, until I get some, you know, more things to do. Then I might start hiring some contractors, but for now, you know, there's so little to do in such small fields. I must well do the work myself. Oh, don't hit your dog. She's just strolling along. So yeah, I'm just gonna put it all into here for now. And uh wait for the cows to eat some of the grass. How are they doing on that? Okay. I'll take that. So how much, how much hay do we end up with? Okay, so 29,000, that's pretty good. That should definitely be enough to last, I guess it'd be, would it be April? Let's see, it won't grow in December. It might be May, but we would actually get the full harvest of grass. That was a fail. Turning it the wrong way. Oh, jeez. And the dog's getting in the way. Come on. One more try. Let's 
trying to keep it looking neat as much as I can. All right, let's just turn that off there. And yeah, so that's uh, that's what we got for today. Ooh, I suppose while I'm thinking about it, um, let's grab this tractor. Let's go and put some fertilizer down. Just to make sure, I mean, we, again, we don't have to lime, but we can also put some fertilizer down to ensure we get the, the best grass yields. I think I can do this all in one pass. Yep, takes not even a minute. It's, it's my kind of thing. All right, um, I'm probably gonna want to set one of my tractors to have uh, narrow tires too at some point, and get one of the uh, sensors on the front and kind of. You know, I can use it for other things, but that'll be the tractor in which I do all my fertilizing just to get some better, uh, some better yields out of everything. All right, one more back in for the day. Right there we go. Let's go park this up. Actually, I'm going to move. I don't know why. I don't think this is why, but I'm going to move this and see if for some reason. Yeah, it's not feeling. If for some reason that's what's causing the issue, let's just put it behind here for now. I hope it's just because of their food. Oh my god. Who put that tree there? I just realized I'm gonna need something to carry these over too. Do you have, have that installed? Don't. I'm gonna have to get I have a um, an auto load um, trailer for pallets and things mod that I like to use, so I'll probably pick that up for the next episode. Which I think we're I think we're just gonna end the uh, uh, let's skip the next day, just because, and then we'll end the episode. To be honest, I'm not even sure if there's anything to do here in the next few months it's just um, you know making sure the, the animals have all their food which cows definitely need some maybe I shouldn't have maybe I should have just fast forwarded it's okay um, chickens are gonna run out yeah I think I'm definitely gonna have to do should have done barley but I'm gonna have to do sorghum for the chickens in that field over there. Um, yeah, and today I'm gonna have to get some, pick up some some hay for the the cows and get them fed. So with that, um, I think I'll leave that to next episode. So uh, thanks for watching, everybody, and I hope you join me again next time. Have a good one.